My mission to find the most weird and wonderful foods has taken me all the way to chocolate heaven, right here in Belgium. <laughs> we all love chocolate, but there's one man who's so obsessed with it that he's dedicated his life to chocolate. He woke up one morning and decided to build his very own chocolate world. I've tracked him down all the way here to a small coastal town in Belgium and I'm going to find out more. This is David, the man with the best job in the world. Welcome to my world of chocolate. This is absolutely, there's such a beautiful smell in this place. It's, yeah, it's extraordinary, it? isn't it? We try to make little jewels one or two bites and the flavors and the taste has to be perfect. Otherwise, I, I won't sell it. This choco bonkers man has created some mysterious concoctions and I'm dying to dive in and test them out. Wow, look at this. It's like a field of chocolate. Can I try one? Yeah, sure. Which one, which one do you suggest? I suggest you start with the passion fruit. That's my favorite, so. But your favorite, oh, well, perfect okay. then. Look at that. Is that covered in a little bit of gold? Yeah, that's a uh, gold dust. Real gold Real dust? gold dust, yes. Enjoy. <laughs> wow! What okay. should I try next, do you think? Mm. The horse's milk. You have to try it. It's, a, it's one of... Uh, it's a favourite chocolate of many customers, so... Oh. Wow. Passion fruit with real gold dust? Horses milk. David uses some really curious ingredients in his truffles, but I reckon I could top that with my very own special flavour. What do you want to make? I'd just like to try something absolutely brand new, a little food adventure. So could you combine crisps with chocolate or cheese and chocolate, something like that? Sounds a bit weird, but uh, I give it a try. If David thinks salty crisps and stinky cheese is weird, I must be onto a winner. First, I need to mash up the crisps and stir them into the melted chocolate. This creates our first layer. Do this nice and quickly before it starts to go soggy. Now for the top layer. Grated Parmesan cheese adds a strong smell and lovely cheesy flavour. Well, hopefully. The final touches leave my chocolates looking like a work of art. So this is just a little bit of mangled up crisps. Give it the final finishing touch. OK, here we go. Time for tasting. Will they be a brilliant new chocolate crispy creation or just a cheesy catastrophe? You ready for this? Yeah. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. A very nice crunch. Mm-hmm. It's got the, tex the texture of sort of peanut butter. Bits yeah. of crunch, very smooth. Yeah. I think I could sell these in my shop. Yeah, honestly. Wow. Yeah. I am blown away. Success! My chocolates are strange and beautiful enough to sell in David's shop. Incredible edibles. Today we're in the